Hello everyone. So today we will have a look on tree traversals. Tree are application of linked list actually, and these are pretty much efficient for retrieving data, right? So today we will be looking at in order traversal. In order traversal of trees. So what are trees? Trees basically are the application of linked list, right? So these basically are application of linked list as we have seen linked list this is the data part and if we make link part before the data and after the data so this is how we can see a tree being generated right so this is the basic structure of tree means in this part also if any node is written like this so it will be having so these red blocks are link part actually we, with this red block i am linking to left side of the tree so this is left side of the tree and this is right side of the tree left side and right side this is left side right side left side right side left side right side and this middle part is data part of the tree data part of the tree right the node from which tree is being started right is called root node the construction of tree from which it is being started is called root node right and these are called child nodes means the nodes which are not having further fabrication mean further uh, childs these are called childs actually child 1 child 2 child 3 so further fabrication is not there for the tree that is called child node right and these are root node and child node right so there are different procedure to count root nodes and child nodes so basic implementation which we are going to do will be with the help of structures right and in today's class we'll see how we can traverse a tree in order right so casually how we make trees casually what we try to do we just make it like this right instead of making these links we just make it like this right but internally while programming we have to implement it like this with the two pointers left and right pointer and with data in the middle part right so what i will do i will just take a tree right and first i with that tree i will show you what is the in order traversal of the tree so this is one tree 50 12 right 30 and 70 then 80 this 10 40 right and this is right only 60 so i have not taken any kind of special tree means binary tree or binary search tree i have just taken a tree right which is having two child nodes usually it is usually if it is having two child it is called binary binary right means it is having two two childs right so i have just taken an example we'll see what is in order traversal of it in order what we mean with the in order in order means first we will traverse to left of the root right then we will traverse to root and then we will traverse to right so in order is left root and right right so why it is called in order the name has been given according to root actually when root is in middle then it is called in order then there is one traversal which is called pre order pre order means root will be traverse first root left and right that is called pre order then there is one traversal that is called post order right so post order is left child right child and then root then it is called post order so this is the definition of in order this is the definition of pre order this is the definition of post order 
Now we'll look at traversal actually. How in order is being applied on this tree, right? How in order is being applied on this tree? So first we, we need to move towards left, right? From root, first we need to move towards left. So left side we need to cover, then root will come and then right side will come, right? So from 50 we reach 12 and then from 12 we reach 70 and from 70 we reach till 10, right? So when we reach 10, there is no left, right? So 10 left is null actually, right? So no left is there, then root is 10 and there is no right, right? So this is being finished. After 10, the root is 70, right? And then it will go to right, then right of it is 40, right? Purposely I have taken this tree so that you can understand the in order traversal properly, right? Now this left side of 12 has been completed. Left side of this 12 has been completed. Now it's in order, right? So 12 will get displayed first, right? Now right of 12 is 80, right? In 80's left there is nothing, right? So we reach till here, we got nothing. <coughs> then we traverse back and we printed root as 80 then we will print it as 60. So now overall left of this tree, right, with root 50 has been traversed, right. Now 50 will get displayed, right, means we will get printed. So now 50 and then 30, right. So this is how we focus on in order traversal. Now quickly we will see how to write code for it. See how to write code for the actually tree structure, no. So we have seen in linked list, right? Now I have just extended that linked list structure. The name will be PT node, right? Binary tree node, right? And LL is left pointer, means what this structure is doing. Data part is there, right? And left pointer is there, which I have written with LL. And right pointer is there, right? So mean is left link and right link. So this is how this structure is being created, right? And now I have made a more, what you say, one more function in which what we will do, we will call this function. This is similar to get a node function in linked list, right? I have written tree node. The name of it is tree node. I will pass a value. What it will do? It will create a memory size, right? It will allocate memory on the heap of this bt size with left link right link right and data it will create this node and the value which you have passed right say if i have passed 50 here right it will set that value as 50 right so once this is being called so what it will do if we are calling it with 50 it will do it will make 50 left link and right link as null right so with null it will initiate so now, now what I will do while creating a node, I will just keep on calling this, right? And this is in order travel set that I will show you later, right? So this is the code for tree node. What I will do now, I just made a root and I call this tree node, right? And get this reference with 50. So it, what it will do, it will make it a, a node with 50, right? Like this and then left link of 50 will have 12 right and right link will have 30 right it will it will take right link will take 30 right this is the same tree which will be constructed actually so what i want to show you is from root left to left means root left link to left link right it is storing the value as 70 you see right and from root left link to right link right it is storing the value as 80 from root left link right link and right link left link right link and then right link after 80 it has stored the value as 60 right from root left link left link left link left link left link and again left link it has stored the value as 10 from root left link left link and right link it has stored the value as 40 right this this is the same tree which i have shown you here 
right this is the same tree which we have seen right so this is how we constructed a tree actually right and now what we have to do we have to implement in order traversal in it right so this is the code for in order traversal what you have to do you just need to call recursively you see in order right i have just named it at display this was display here actually earlier right i just named it as in order anyway while code i will show this thing will get replaced with in order actually same function i need to call actually so what it is happening with in order right in order just pass the root node right and what it will do it will take one pointer now p left left means if left side is having any value again call this same function right so instead of display there will be in order written actually here right with left node and then if left is not having anything then display the data right that is that means with when we reach to the root right display the data if left is not having anything right and if left is having something then go to keep on going to left print the left data right and then go to the root and print the right data so what basically it means is go to the left side of the this in both the places in order should be written right? so recursively when you call in order internally it will check if left side is having some data right if it is having then go again call in order on the left subtree again call in order on the left subtree and then after displaying the root again call in order on the right subtree this is the basic actually right of the code you see how this code is being executed right in vs code so the same function with left node this is the tree node this thing will give us new nodes of the tree right this is the in order right you see i have called in order inside it uh, when i have declared first pointer and then i have created one local pointer which will go to the left side then in order it will call recursively call this function only and we will print root whenever left side is free we will print root right after printing left side it it will print root and then it will go to right side and then it will print the right side you see if right side is having so this is the same function and i have called this function here in order right so let's run it so we can see this is the output actually 10 70 40 12 80 60 50 30 so this is the same output which we have expected actually so this is the same output which we were looking at the code earlier no 10 40 12 80 60 50 30 right in here it is given 12 right so in this code i have given i have not taken the value right so that's how 10 70 40 i have changed some values but it is giving in order only right so this is how we implement in order 12 traversal actually 10 70 40 12 80 right so thank you 10 70 40 12 80 60 50 30 10 70 40 12 80 60 50 30 yeah same tree right so we will see pre-order and post-order in further classes